to Hyde Park in Boston to hear from Christopher at Boston Community Leadership Academy. I was diagnosed with Libra's hereditary optic neuropathy, which left me with central vision loss. I am blind, but I have great vision. I began to lose my sight when I was 15 years old. My parents took me to six different eye specialists where I lived in Port-au-Prince, the capital of Haiti. All the doctors gave me the same prognosis. The vision that I had lost could not be restored. It was getting challenging to adjust. Things that were easy before became more difficult, like watching TV, playing basketball and soccer with my friends. Although I struggled, I was hopeful that I would get more positive news at the next appointment. However, I knew that if I didn't regain my vision, I would be fine in the long run because of my faith. In May of 2016, I traveled to the United States alone, leaving behind my parents and my little sister. Neither of my parents were granted an American visa, so they couldn't accompany me. About a year after I came to the U.S., I took a coding class where I learned the basics of programming. I realized then that one day I would be able to create tools that would help me, but more importantly, that would help others in need. And that became my goal and passion in life to pursue a career in computer science. During my first few weeks at school in the US, I was provided with technology that helped me to once again access information and read and write independently. I learned how to use computer with magnification and speech software I also learned how to use CCTVs and I began learning Braille. In my class and I visited Harvard University and heard from Dr. Cornel West, who reminded us that being rich is good, but giving back to the community is great. Giving back in these ways has allowed me to make my community not just good, but great. Coming to the U.S. may not have healed me physically, but it gave me something else. It gave me hope for a better tomorrow. I started seeing the world with a more optimistic view.